applied for the grant because as like most small businesses or medium-sized businesses growing, um, you know, there's always a strain on cash flow. So the funding that was there was perfect and the timing was great. The project funded a, a new device that we've, that we've designed to detect bikes when they're in a certain style of bike rack. There's a big market in Holland for that, 30,000 bikes are stored at stations daily, maybe one or 2,000 here, so it's growing. So it will enable us and enable the railway stations to know where a bike is, when it was put there, um, and when a, when a space is freed up. Applying for the grant actually was really easy. Um, the, the, the forms weren't complicated, they were very simple, very easy to read. It's helping us develop products and, and projects, and it's pushing us up and over the competition. We applied for the grant because we had launched the world first printing process called Light Touch. We've benefited massively from the result of the funding because it's enabled us uh, to increase our marketing activity and therefore generate additional awareness of our revolutionary uh, new process Light Touch. Without the funding we wouldn't have been as effective as a product launch. Gobbler Boats is quite special. We started off in 2009 actually doing, a, doing our research. Our boat now is the only one in the world. It has an absolutely unique certification for a 29 foot boat that only draws 16 inches, able to go out 150 miles into the ocean. The fact here is we can pick up oil at 40 tonnes an hour, water free, everything reusable, and it's what we need to help the environment. The grant funded us to get into, in, into Seaworks. It was one of the things we needed to do to be able to get our product across to the world in, in a single show. We were able to win the major prizes of construction and design and also for the spirit of innovation. Without that funding we wouldn't have been able to get there. Mm -hmm.